Are you having trouble with video streaming or connecting your baby unit to the parent unit when connected to Wi-Fi? Here are a few recommendations to help improve the performance of your video monitor. Let's begin with the baby unit. First, make sure the baby unit is turned on. Once you have confirmed that the baby unit is on, raise the antenna on the parent unit. This will ensure that you always receive the best connection signal. When your monitor is connected to Wi-Fi, the parent unit and baby unit are communicating over your Wi-Fi network. You should see the Wi-Fi signal strength icon on the top left corner of your parent unit. When the signal strength is full, this indicates the signal is strong between the Wi-Fi router and the video baby monitor. You should experience a smooth video streaming. If you see the following Wi-Fi icon, it means that the device is receiving a weak or interrupted Wi-Fi signal. The problem may be because the parent unit is too far away from the baby unit. Or sometimes, internal walls may be blocking the connection. To help improve the quality of the signal, raise the antenna on the parent unit, or if possible, relocate the parent unit or baby unit with a weak signal closer to the Wi-Fi router. Keep in mind that an intermittent or unreliable Wi-Fi may cause problems for your video baby monitor. This may occur more frequently if your router is several years old, Sometimes the solution is as simple as unplugging your Wi-Fi router for 30 seconds, then plugging it in again. If this does not resolve your trouble, you can reinstall your monitor on the Wi-Fi network. To do this, go to Network Settings. Select Configure Wi-Fi to scan, then update or change your Wi-Fi network. For more helpful tips, subscribe to the VTech Support channel or check out our videos to keep watching.